Runes are magical signs that came to us from the Norse tradition from the Norse gods. They are magical instruments used for the purpose of changing the world. We are learning how to use them appropriately. But I would like to tell you right away, runes do not accept everyone. This means that it could happen that you would be prohibited from working within a pagan system if you are a Christian. Thus, in this case, you should be asking your patron, the one who oversees you, that is the one who will either allow or prohibit you from engaging with runes. I've seen it quite often that the Christian egregor would allow a person to engage with the runes, would let her reach a certain point, and then it says no, you've learned the instrument, but you are not allowed to go through with the initiation. You are not allowed to initiate your consciousness to the Norse gods. Or vice versa, despite a person's mental desire to engage with the runes, it just steers the person away from them. Or when the patron detects the protégé's desire and says, no, I forbid you. This happens very often, especially lately. Sometimes the runes themselves don't accept some people if they reason that they can't teach them. The thing is that runes is the type of instrument that is made for the members of the warrior caste, more than for any other caste. So it's clear that should runes be given to people to the, of the laborer caste, and God forbid they are taught how to use runes, then we won't see much besides casting of curses and fortune telling.